the present study found that patients who developed long COVID after SARS-CoV-2 infection had distinctive immune profiles compared to those who developed mild or severe COVID-19. These differences included a shift towards a resting NK cell phenotype and increased levels of neutrophils that form extracellular traps. Additionally, the study identified several proteins that could be used as biomarkers to predict the development of long COVID. These proteins include ANGPT1, VEGFA, CCR7, CD56, citrullinated histone 3, elastase, and transforming growth factor beta 1. Furthermore, the study suggests that these proteins may be involved in the development of long COVID through their connection to vascular inflammation and tumor necrosis factor alpha. Finally, the study also found evidence of a vascular proliferative state associated with hypoxia-induced factor 1 pathway suggesting that this process may contribute to the development of long COVID. This article was authored by Christiana Iosef, Michael J. Nauer, Michael Nicholson, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.